Hey guys, welcome back to another video on the Road Builder YouTube channel. Today we're continuing on the Mega Map series and uh, oh man, do we have some work to do today. I definitely want to do the elevation. So anywhere where the road elevates, we have one over on that side and two over on this side. And anywhere the road elevates, I just want to connect it to the ground. And to do that, I'm just going to scale these down. I think that's going to be the easiest way. And then we're going to later on mask that with terrain, whether that's uh, triangle hills, which I think I want to try some triangle terrain in this build just because I don't do it too often. In fact, I don't think I've ever done it in a video or on a released game. So I am excited to do that. First off, we're just going to connect everywhere to the ground. I guess just to make it not look floating would be the best way to say that. What do I want to do right here? Over here, I'm going to do some sort of arch. I think that would be the coolest way to, uh, to go about that. I guess I could just delete and duplicate this. Perfect. And guys, after we go around all of this and get everything connected with the ground, we're going to add in some terrain. I think we're going to try to get all terrain done in this video like not the buildings yet but we're gonna try to make the whole map not seem flat so when you spawn into it you can't just see for example the other side of the map i think it'll be really cool and i am excited about this map guys i genuinely think this will be one of the better maps i've made on roblox scale that back bring this down some more if we want we can even add designs on these walls i think that could be cool as well all right guys all sidewalks are connected to the ground we have this little uh, circle spot over here and then all of this as well everything is connected to the ground except the ends here i have a feeling later on i might make something out of underneath this i don't know exactly what up next i need to work on terrain i don't know if i'm gonna do triangles blocks or meshes so i have to figure that out first but this will be all of the sort of mountain terrain and everything like over here we're gonna need uh an elevated sort of thing i don't know how i'm gonna do that yet either but it's gonna be cool nonetheless think in triangle terrain but we'll just have to see all right guys my triangle terrain plugin is not working so we're not gonna go over blocky but we're gonna do pretty much what we did for the ground and then just redo that but make it have layers if that makes sense so we have a part here for example grab this and let's sort of uh let's just grab uh what is it called archimedes there we go and then we need to change this to a yaw there we go and now that we have this we're gonna render and then we're gonna cut it to like negative um i don't know 50 yeah that'll work render render the spawn is going to be right here which will be a building so i kind of want to wrap this if i can so it'll go sort of behind the building and i also think i want to have it go something like this wrap off the island and then back onto the island so something like this guys because then i can have a waterfall here and i think that would look pretty cool honestly without further ado that is what i must do uh let's change this to like a 10 there we go and then let's go to a 25 nice boom 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 there we go we're starting to cut it back in and now we can do uh negative i don't know 30 like this and go out more something like that now what we need to do is kind of go back around so we have a clean outline to do that i'm just gonna keep it on this and uh just kind of change the settings every once in a while so it's not like a perfect circle and then we'll just put it like put it like this render all right guys so now that we have this sort of uh elevated terrain here and now we just have to fill it in so all you do is kind of grab and stretch them across that's the best way that i've found how to do this anyways all right so now that we have all of this terrain right here we're gonna select all of it go to our building tools by f3x which is a pretty powerful plugin i just don't use it too much shift d or no control d since we're using the plugin and then we could bring all of this down at once perfect and look we can even scale all of them in as you can see it did affect all of them it does give us some ugly edges uh but you know i don't think we really have to talk about that let's change this to brown there we go now we have a little bit of terrain elevation around the spawn i have to do this process all right guys i've been working on the map quite a bit we have a lot of terrain changes which is nice spawn building is done which is also nice and now uh i need to work on like the lighting i guess because the colors are just they're just not great and and then also the watercolor. I want to move more towards my style. So what we're going to do is hop into terrain, click on watercolor, and uh, I'm just going to pick screen color and 
boom there we go now the water at least matches my waterfall it's a lot brighter now let's hop into lighting because uh yeah you know what i'ma just i'ma just delete everything it, it, yeah this already looks better in my opinion all right so let's add in this color correction pretty simple stuff and now let's do our actual lighting settings because uh yikes that could be helps let's go for like a white already the brightness this screams row builder build style change our diffuse and specular scale set this to a pure white as well all right guys we are now officially lit as the young fellows say my disappointment is immeasurable and my day is removed. and i don't exactly know what i'm gonna do next vegetation maybe but i think i'm just gonna bring them in i don't overly think i'm gonna place them all around because well it doesn't make sense before the buildings i guess so for this video let's get some trees and some rocks in here oh my gosh solid cloud fellas okay let's let's not do that though something like this i think and just like that we got two trees and some rocks um i think think that's pretty cool and for today oh i can also put these fences around i made these little fences uh and i'll put them around this area i think that'd be cool like a sort of a safe zone if you will uh but guys that is gonna wrap it up for today if you did enjoy and you want to see more content like this please make sure to like comment and subscribe have a great day later